The 48th Infantry Brigade stationed in Macon will head to Afghanistan in January. The Georgia National Guard unit has been training for more than a month, but got a chance to spend Thanksgiving with their families. Abby Casaurus explains how the families are preparing for that time apart. And the Army more than 100 soldiers with the 48th Brigade said goodbye to their home base in Macon. I like having my family at home. And their families. I just find him my hero. Rolinda McKnight and her husband Jim have four girls and a newborn boy. They say saying goodbye is always hard. Yeah, I think my wife's sacrifice is greater than mine. It's going to be hard for her to be home with the kids for the next nine months without me. But It's a really good opportunity to teach our children about selfless service and what it means to be an American and serve. McKnight's family still plans on seeing each other at Christmas before his unit deploys in January, but they say prayers and their faith give them strength. Nicole Capaccio and her husband Michael just got married in September. They spent their first Thanksgiving together in Orlando with their dogs Coco Puff and Ziggy. He's my one and only. Um, he's there for everything. Nicole says she'll support her husband, but he won't hear her say goodbye. I, I don't like that that word of goodbye because it, it's almost a, a, a final word, and that's not what that's not what's going to happen. These photos the family took during their time together, preserving lots of smiles, will keep both Jim and Michael going when they spend up to a year overseas. In Macon, Abby Casores, 13 WMAZ News. Master Sergeant Gerard Brown says they'll have another sending off from Fort Stewart near Savannah on December 21st, and then most of the soldiers will spend Christmas with their families before they deploy in January. He says their mission could take anywhere from nine months to a year.